Hello and welcome. Welcome back. Welcome for the first time. If you're just dropping by, oh, I'm so glad you stopped. Uh, this may not be your uh, your full impression of what you thought you would get when you clicked on a hardcore vanilla Minecraft stream. Um, but uh, I, I think if you stick it out, you'll see uh, we're, we're working on something pretty awesome here. But enough, uh, enough nonsense and yammering on. Let's get this world loaded up. Uh, for anybody returning who watched the last episode, I uh, just took a nice break and had a thought. I think there's one more thing that we need to do before we we just dive in, <laughs> literally, to uh, filling in our water. Um, so bear with me just a moment as we... Let's just get enough... Um, as we top off the shoots, right? So here's what I mean. We've got four more of our six shoots. And now that we've got dirt blocks around and everything flowing, I think we want to just make real sure... that all of this doesn't have any room to be confusing or throw off our work to finish up the water once we get going, right? We're going to know exactly what needs it and what doesn't uh, just by appearing. And once we have a bunch of dirt uh, lines running all over the place, trying to figure that out could get a bit more difficult. So this should be a time saver. See, like these are going to remain, but we need to move those and refill them. Also, having this all the way blocked in gives us more anchor points for the water buckets themselves. Uh, so less less dirt that we have to place and then remove. Uh, just in general, good stuff. All right, so one, two, three, and then we've got the one over on the far side. Let's do this. Probably a, oh, a little faster. Cutting the corner and falling to our death would not be a time saver. Let's not do that. All right, so here, here, here. I think that gets us all set up. So now we can go back down grab our put away our bricks fill our buckets and be off and try to just cruise through this as quickly not frantically really but efficiently quick as possible which the Everybody knows the best way to do that is to jump through. All right. Six, seven, eight. Now we need one more. Um, let's just assume that that was a reason to have more dirt. I don't know what, what that was. Uh, we'll try to run a little bit hungry, too, with the apples. Just save them for when, when needed. And I guess oh. always the way. Let's come over here. Um, now, in addition to oh. Uh, you 
dirty rat. Dirt. Okay, I got the bucket. Got the bucket, not the thing. <laughs> That's no good. Um, zip. There we go. So, I think the best thing we can do is just do it in a grid and uh, frame out these sections as best we can. We'll do, oh boy, uh, as much as time allows, that's going to waste our dirt. So let's try not to do that. That one. Some of these are a little. All right, one, two. Okay, I think that's a good start. So all we uh, all we'd ever hoped for an uninterrupted chance to pour buckets of water in the sky and then juggle them. Better than the three at a time we were doing before, though, right? Now we come back around on this side. Oops. Oops. That should be the uh, the difference maker right there. That and having more buckets. That's done. Now we're going to do this one, and then we'll remove the dirt. Got to do one of these. Start the stack.
Uh. Okay, then that worked out pretty well. Bed. I get coffee, have a second cup. Do not want bed to fall. Whew. Right. Stack those. Switch that. That goes away. here. This one still needs one there. There. Alright. Now... Uh, I guess we're doing this. Kind of forgot how we did all that, but oh, well, at least I picked it back up. Yeah, this is the kind of awful. Oh, I guess I could be over on. That one doing it. I don't know. I think this is just the the tedious price we have to pay uh, for getting this this set up and running. But it'll it'll come along. I can't tell if they're blowing out sprinklers. I, I'm guessing you guys haven't heard it. It's kind of generator type sound, or compressor really. Um, it's kind of not right outside my stuff. So I don't really see anything about it. It may not be too noticeable, but I'm going to notice it now because it just stopped. <laughs> That's always the way it goes, right? As soon as, as soon as you lose something you've been hearing for a while, it's gone. And there. All right, well, that's a good big old chunk. Get that one. That and that. Um, may as well just go on a One across, right? Oh. Stop! This is where we get to get frustrated. And I really hope that any of you guys watching that did hear my plea um, in a previous episode didn't just decide to let me struggle. If if there was insights into a better way to get all this done, um, I wish you would have told me. But 
I didn't see any comments. I think this is a, a fairly decent way to get this done. I don't think there's a really great way to get it done, so... Anyway, that isn't uh, too awful. And boom. All right, couple sections we can undo now. Give us up to our. Uh, I guess if we're starting a new mode, let's just... opportunity Okay, then we got up a few of these wherever they may be. Just look at a little bit more time. Seems weird. Oh, what? It seems really weird when you put the blocks in a spot where they don't even need to be.
bed break. Well, not. At least it's close by. I guess that's the dirt that is I don't know, I kinda feel like I wanna just keep these going to break it up. Having to do a few of these in a row is kinda miserable. Um we'll see. Okay, all that is done. Swap one, boom, 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 boom. that backwards, didn't I? Shoot. Well, nothing to do for it now. Okay, so only those, that will keep us no other reason than we just want to be able to see where we're, um, where we're sending our blocks, or refilling our buckets at. So that's the intent there. This is another big one. We got through our narrow little section. I'm afraid to look at time. I think it'll be too depressing <laughs> to see how much we've already used. Uh, was it been two game days? Two full game days? Oh, the flip side is you can kind of do more with these buckets when you have big old... 
co-ops to do. And always get stuck a bucket short. Cause that's how it works. goofed up that because we're I don't know why you do that when you're like hanging right on the edge and trying to point at the top of the block. It seems like that should be tougher to do. Alright, I think that will uh, be a good chunk. that point maybe we will oh we should uh uh empty that or just join in that source water get rid of those dirts cuz all the others will be closer at that point i think before we get to all that though. Alright. Now this is where Try to learn to do better.
Okay. Two more here. <laughs> so those because I can. When we get done sleeping, we check time. Sound like a plan? Uh, I thought you guys would love it. 31. 32 almost. So that's not too bad. I think we'll be well past this little water hole by the time we get done. I don't know that we can get it all done, but honestly, I thought it was going to take... better part of a week to do all this so I'm not too disappointed at where we're at here 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 Last little bucket. All set. reached our second sleeping platform. Maybe we'd never even get to use it. How great would that be? fishy. Why? Uh, I don't know. Felt like the right time to do it.
Okay, and as promised, as a final farewell, now this one I think I want to do here, here. Here. And before we get too far, so I think that is going to make this just perfect. That little lip of dirt. Awesome. Uh, oops. Yeah, so about that dirt. Come on. Oh. And filled before lost forever. All right, so that stuff's all good. In case anyone is wondering, yeah, I think we'll just raise the roof. If we put blocks in here, we're going to remove everything we've done, and we're operating a layer higher than we did over in the test section. So we'll just, just pop everything up a block layer on the inside, um, not on the blue. We'll just pull this uh, brick back and uh, cover everything within it. Um, should be fine. But that was a that was a mistake. All right now. Seriously? So I wasn't really done with these yet. That seems odd. Probably trouble at some point. Because why wouldn't it be?
a little bit of lawnmower sound. Oh, so I almost forgot. Here, let's uh, let's get through our sleep. And uh, then we can talk about our real highlight. Oh, so we did. There is trouble. What is going on here? Let's go to sleep. Figure it out. Uh, coffee. Time check. 42. Almost 43. Okay. We've got what appears to be a mess there. And... This one that I think was what... Oh! Just get up on the dirt! Was the one that missed last time. nice when the dirt is heavily used and gives you the extra little wiggle bucket. Maybe that's something to keep in mind for the future is spare one bucket in your total potential inventory just to speed change out without having to first place that uh, single bucket. It's a much quicker change out. Almost lets you get a little rhythm going. This way.
Yes, we can do there. Okay. Nice little narrow section, though. Definitely good to be through those. And have to do that one after. Still got a little bit of room here. In the next episode, we'll have to get signs for down there access point, and then those will be the last thing that we uh, kind of clear out. We'll go over and do the other side or whatever. We don't really need the scaffold anymore. All right, how we doing? Ten minutes. Maybe get a couple of these done. All right, we're we're moving pretty good now. I think. If I could have started my row at the right place. There. There, there, Um, oh, I forgot, now we're almost done, um, I forgot the fun, exciting topic going on today, so, uh, there is a version of Habbage cooking in my crock pot today, um, with all those awesome cool mornings and everything finally got down to where i was like i can i can use a crock pot in my place and not worry about it just non-stop forcing the ac to run to try to compensate for it um so i am surrounded by awesome smells i've got some beans um a regular medium onion yellow onion 
um, some oh, what's I put in there? Seems like there was something more than uh, there's a bunch of mushrooms. But I thought I had something else already going. Oh, uh, it's not technically ham. Don't don't get angry, but uh, some turkey sausage, like a, a dinner sausage kind of deal, and uh, yeah, spices. A little a little stock in there for flavor. I think this is our nearest bed spot. So yeah, I'm pretty, pretty well happy with how all that came out. Okay, if you're gonna be a little slow, I'm gonna go fill my buckets. Don't say I didn't warn you. There we go. Uh, yeah, so I got uh, spices and seasonings and all that kind of stuff going in there. And I think I did one cook over the summer when it wasn't too terribly hot, but basically this is the first time in a long time I've had, uh, had anything out of the crock pot. And of course I have a head of cabbage to, uh, add into the mix uh, very late in the cook, right? If you, if you throw cabbage into a crock pot for a dozen hours, you're basically going to have cabbage flavor and not much else. It's uh, going to cook down to basically nothing. So keep that for a bit later, chop up the head and throw it in, and uh, I expect deliciousness, delicious with heat, it's got, uh, got quite a bit of spice in it this time. So yeah, that's, uh, that's going, every break I get, I get to uh, get going in like the first episode today. I had, uh, you know, just gotten all the first ingredients and everything going, and I was sitting here kind of getting up, and my eyes kept watering, and I wasn't really, I was like, man, is it just, you know, waking up with the allergies and all that kind of stuff? As you guys know, it's it's been breezy, which is nice, um, but it's definitely stirred up some, I think, foggier stuff. And it's still early to call it fall. It's it's very summery, really, but the cooling off has me thinking of how great it's going to be. Alright, I know I'm checking like every couple minutes. But we're at 56. Let's, uh, let's go, excuse me, hiccup. Yeah, I think uh, I think we could be into capping this up on the next one. We'll see. I mean, that's all pretty narrow. <laughs> we got a good start, but uh, let's not go too celebratory. I think once we get up close to our scaffold, we'll probably jump over and come back from the other side, though. I'll kind of do this center part last. But undeniable progress. You gotta admit we're we're doing something right here. So good stuff. Let's uh, go ahead and save it out there. Um, thank you all for coming by. I really appreciate it. I know it's you know it's a grind, but I I think a two part, maybe a two with a little bit left over part grind, we can handle that. So. Uh, Thanks so much. Hope you uh, 
hope you keep uh, keep coming back for more. Uh, we're getting close to seeing this thing uh, crank it out the drowned. And hopefully when we get to that point, we'll have Trident jam in our pockets. But until then, and as always, stay awesome out there, guys. Uh, take the breaks that I'm taking. I, I definitely get up, move around, do stuff in addition to stirring the crock pot each time I have that opportunity. So I'm going to get out and uh, stretch the legs real good, get some exercise in. I mean, it's tough to call that. I'm going to go for a little half mile walk around my complex probably and squint in the, the bright sun and enjoy the fact that there's not wildfire smoke clogging up the air. It'll be awesome. So you guys uh, do the same and we'll come back here and talk about it all next time. Bye now.